the reveal of Robert Pattinson in the new Batman suit comes a lot of fan speculation. Now I'm going to give my thoughts on the bat suit in this video. But before I do that, make sure you guys subscribe down below and hit the bell icon for it will notify you whenever I have a new upload that is released. And please comment down below and let me know what you guys think of the suit. First off, I want to say is Robert Pattinson definitely looks really good in the Batman suit. He has the jawline for it. He definitely looks like he's also building up muscle for the suit to fill it, just to fill it in a little bit, fill it up, you know, so it's a little bit more filled in. And he definitely does look really good in the suit. And with this 55 second teaser that we got, or not even a teaser, it's a camera test of him in the suit, uh, there's really not a lot of, to go off of. But I'm going to do my best to go off of the footage that we did receive. So, here we go. First thing that you'll notice is the bat symbol. Now, there has been a lot of speculation behind what it is. Personally, I think it's going to be a weapon that comes off of his chest that he could use in battle, which would be really awesome. And the armor plating on the suit definitely looks really nice. Now, one speculation by fans that is made is that the armor on the bat symbol and the reason why it's all metal is because it's made of the gun that killed his parents uh, and he converted it into the bat symbol which is a really unique concept and i think that would be really interesting and really dark for this character for them to do go in this direction i think it would be really interesting and very unique and something we've never seen before and also the other thing that you guys will notice is if i brighten up the image a little bit uh there is stitching on the cowl now people say it's sewn together it is sewn together you can clearly see that but one thing that you guys may not have noticed is that the pattern of stitching on the batman cowl is in the same pattern as the Adam West cowl from the Batman 1966 series with Adam West. Rest in peace, Adam West, by the way. Also, the suit looks extremely functional. It looks very operational. It's very, it looks, it's a prototype suit. You can tell that it's a prototype suit. Uh, it's definitely not going to be his official, official suit. I believe he's going to wear more suits in the movie. But this, I believe, is a prototype suit. And this is apparently his second year as Batman. And so you can see that very functional look to it. Looks like it could really function. And that's one thing that I notice. It looks uh, slightly, I would say, even more functional than the um, Dark Knight series with Christian Bale. Slightly more functional. Probably not as real and grounded, but slightly more functional, I believe, would be the word to use for the way the suit looks. Which, unlike the Michael Keaton films, the Michael Keaton Batman suit looked fantastic. It definitely looked fantastic, but it definitely was not a very functional thing. So you can tell that they're trying to have comic book elements in there with the suit, but also keep it mostly grounded and real with the way the suit looks and operates. Also, there is speculation that the suit is going to be blue, or that's what the director said, it's going to be blue and gray. So, we haven't gotten official colored images of the pic of the suit, but it's definitely going to be blue and gray, and that's a very interesting direction for them to go, especially since that's the look they had in the comic books quite a few times. And yeah, the suit does look fantastic. The red lighting that they have around him, a lot of people said it looks like Daredevil with the red lighting. Personally, I think it's just the color scheme that they're going for because even with the little image that the director released while filming, you can see in the title of the film that the words the Batman are in red. So I think red is a color scheme that they're really going with in this movie as well. And yeah, uh, that's my thoughts on the suit overall. I really think it looks promising. Uh, the suit looks great on Pattinson. He really does work in it. Now, the only question is, can the man perform in the suit and can he do a good job? That's for us to see in the movie. 
And uh, yeah, that's my thoughts on the overall suit. If you guys liked the video, make sure to subscribe today to join the Isaiahization.